ladies and gentlemen, the first and second place heifers in the International Milking Shorthorn Show are now walking into the ring. I'd like to introduce you to them. Winning the spring heifer calf class was entry 677, our way Liriano Alicia 14th EXP, shown by Dylan Lean of Brooklyn, Wisconsin. Second place went to 695, Heavenly Frito ET, shown by Brett Grebner of Heavenly Show Cattle, Monroe, Wisconsin. There were 19 spring calves shown. 22 were in the winter heifer calf class. That class was won by entry 712, Heavenly Zippy, shown by Brett Grebner of Heavenly Show Cattle, Monroe, Wisconsin. And second to entry 720, Lazy M Pirelli Girl Crush EXPET, shown by Lazy M Farm LLC, Michael and Herman Meyer, Stitzer, Wisconsin. 20 fall calves were shown today. First in the class went to 726, Lazy M PS Jokes on You EXPET, shown by Shaylin Schoon, Lancaster, Missouri. Second to 737, Gibbs Zeus Cali EXPET, shown by Lincoln Gibbs, Epworth, Iowa. There were 16 summer yearlings. The winning entry was 758 Twilight Are You Ready EXP. She was shown by Logan and Kirsten Latier of Latier's Twilight Farm. Entry 756 was second. Sagisser Red Reuben Night Moves EXP, shown by Peter Vale and High Point Partners, Cross Plains, Wisconsin. The spring yearling class had 17 entries. 782 won the class, Heavenly Cream Puff, shown by Jonathan Clark, Cornish, New Hampshire. Entry 768 was second, Buckeye Knoll Logic Precious, shown by Sarah Rhodes of Greenville, Ohio. There were 10 winter yearlings. The winning entry was 786, Trillo Zeus Lala ET, shown by Tristan and Willow Upchurch and Susan Lee, Tulare, California. Second was entry 790, Solid Gold Patriot Pepsi ET, shown by Spencer Michael Weimer of Emlinton, Pennsylvania. There were nine fall yearlings. The winning entry was 796. Innisfail Mega LaCroix ET, shown by John Stewart Rao and Katie Bue, Alma Center, Wisconsin. And second went to 798. Solid Gold Patriot Pizza ET, shown by Spencer Michael Weimer of Emlinton, Pennsylvania. Ladies and gentlemen, our judges this uh, afternoon into the evening, Eric Topp and Lee Harris, have placed a total of 113 heifers in the 2016 International Milking Shorthorn Show. Let's show, our, show them our appreciation and these exhibitors our congratulations on a job very well done. Congratulations to you all. Judge Top, are you ready? Who is junior champion of this year's International Milking Shorthorn Show? Well, it's been a terrific uh, heifer show. Uh, I think when uh, me and Lee got these out here, we uh, didn't know how many we would pull out, but we're ex excited to see these five heifers out here. We got our first prize intermediate calf, uh, first and second prize spring yearling, first prize winter yearling, and pr first prize fall yearling. They're heifers. You admire the femininity. You love the daringness. You love the cleanliness. But most of all, heifers will walk out with a tremendous set of feet and legs and have that beautiful sweep to the rib. And as you can probably see today, you know, they didn't have to be the biggest, but they had to be heifers that were correct, heifers exhibit balance, have that femininity, and heifers going to turn into great cows. Uh, before uh, we select here, uh, I'd just like to thank World Dairy Expo on their 50th. Just been a thrill for me and Lee to be out here. Um, it's just been so exciting and, uh, you know, more than what I dreamed of when we got out here for this heifer show. Um, the numbers were good, but the quality was even better yet. Um, I'll go out and I'll congratulate my uh, junior champion, reserve, and honorable mention, but let's give every one of these uh, sh Milk and Shorthorn exhibitors a tremendous round of applause for the great show.
congratulations to the junior champion of the International Melking Shorthorn Show, the winning winter calf, Heavenly Zippy, shown by Brett Grebner of Heavenly Show Cattle, and reserve junior champion to the winter yearling, Trillo Zeus Lala E.T., shown by Tristan and Willow Upchurch and Susan Lee, Tulare, California. And honorable mention honors to that winning fall yearling, Innisfail Mega LaCroix E.T., shown by John Stewart Rao and Katie Bue, Alma Center, Wisconsin. Out here for junior champion, this, uh, when this winter calf came in here, I just uh, thought it was going to be hard pressed for me and Lee to find a heifer that was going to be to beat her. She's a heifer, you can paint her any color, and she's going to be right there in the front of the pack. She's a heifer, she's stylish, she's feminine, she's a heifer, walks out on a tremendous set of feet and legs, hard top, and you just love the style and the balance and the show ring presence that she has. For reserve junior champion, I think a heifer, she's not the biggest heifer out there today in their class, but she's a heifer you admire the straightness of the line. She's feminine through that head and neck today. You love the daringness, you love the angularity, you love the depth of fore and rear rib and the tremendous uh, set of rear legs that she has. And I'm giving her advantage over our fall yearling. She's just a little stronger in the loin today. Also, I'm giving her advantage. She's a little more cleaner through that head and neck today, cleaner than the thigh, than this real stylish fall yearling. You admire this fall yearling for that size and scale, the stretch, the power and strength, the hardness across the top. But three beautiful heifers out here for junior reserve and honorable mention. Let's give these another nice round of applause.